Hi everybody, Dan here. Today I'm going to show you how to make a double-sided shader in Blender 2.8. Let's start with the plane where we assign a, just a color, in this case it's red, and we want to have on the other side of the polygon a different color or a different shade altogether. So I'm going to create a second shader. This time I'm gonna change it to blue so we can see the difference. And if I sign to the polygon, I will have both sides in blue. So what I need is a mix shader. Well, each shader will be assigned to one of the node. With the mix shader, the shader is gonna be mixed. So mixing this red with the blue, I'm gonna have course some kind of purple changing the fact of course I can have more of one of more of the other what we'll need is something connecting to the fact that will define which shader is showing depending on the side of our polygon so let's add another node geometry node and this geometry node we're gonna select back facing into the function and now you can see you have the magenta on one side and blue on the other side. There are not so many objects that are so thin, so you may want two different shaders on the side of uh, a geometry. But for example, if you are modeling some money and I have already some texture of a note, let's use the color on one side. And as you can see, I have my $10 note here and on the other side I have just the blue and then I use another texture on the other shader and now I have my note and this is also the quickest way to make money with Blender <laughs> using the same technique I am going to show you this other example, which is a box that has two material and I used the same technique, so geometry back facing channel into the fuck with two different material, the white for inside and the red from the external. But if you want a geometry that looks like this one, where we have some thickness See, we have some thickness while the other one has only one face, there's no thickness at all. In this case, you cannot use the same shader that we use for the double-sided. This is not a double-sided material. This is an object with two different material assigned in different parts of the object. So if I select this object, I can show you that we have two different materials, red and white. And each one is assigned to different parts of the object. So if we go in edit mode and I select, you'll see that I assign the red material to some of the object, that is the external part, while the white one is another selection altogether while this other object has no geometry inside so we have only a cube basically with a face removed on top and we're using a double-sided shader now from a distance this will work but if you're working very close to an object you want to show some some more geometry probably so this technique is not ideal. Quickly to add two material to the same object, so not double sided but just different parts colored in different way, you want to select the faces that you want in a different color for example, then you can add the material slot, change the parameter of your material to whatever you want, blue, red, I don't know, and assign. And now we have a material with two different shaders assigned to different parts. Now if you look inside this object, you will see that actually the material is based on the face and the face 
no matter where it's facing, will be that material. If I add some depth to this object, for example, solidify would do. You can see that I have different material assigned to the whole object. At this point, if I want, for example, the inside to be completely white, I need to select the faces that I want to change. I go to material, I sign, select the material I want, sign. And then if I want the external to be completely red, I select the faces that I want to change, select the material and assign. And now we have our object with two different materials. I hope you enjoyed this uh, short tutorial. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions about this technique or any other technique for any future video. And please subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much. Bye.